Just like hunting for game, fishing for a triple tail in the late summer is a matter of getting to where they live. But once you find it, you're likely to hook more than just one. Chief Meteorologist Jason Smith takes us out on Mobile Bay in this week's Outdoors. Summertime is a great time to ride around and look for triple tail in our local bays. I did just that with Captain Joey Gates on a sunny, calm day. All right, what I'm doing is I'm just taking this big shrimp here, putting him on a treble hook, and I've got some real stout leader. This is a 50-pound test, a 40-pound braid, and I've just got him under a cork with a little split shot, and I'm going to throw him up against this marker, see if there's a fish here. There he is. Let's go, let's go, let's go. He's a good one. Way to go, way to go, way to go. All right. I saw him eat it. Good fish. Yeah. It's a good fish. We're just going to go ahead and get him in the boat. Look at this. This is a real nice triple tail. And he, he, had, he, he, <laughs> he didn't even really know he's hooked yet, guys. That's a great fish. Beautiful fish. Look at that beautiful triple tail there. There he is. Dun, 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 dun. Nice triple tail here on outdoors and the thing is, is this is probably not the prettiest fish you've ever seen but he's one of the best eating fish out here. The fish ended up weighing right at 14 pounds. That's a solid fish but it wasn't the biggest on this trip. Joey's son Caleb Gates got his shot at one later in the day. He's on. Good fish. Well that's a fine triple tail Caleb. Come on, keep him up, keep his tip up. Hey! Look at the size of that tail, Caleb. That's a good one. Woo, That's a good real one. good one. Uh -huh, there you Look go. at that size of that triple tail, boy. <laughs> this fish was a good two pounds bigger. What a hard fighting fish, and they are great eating too. For Fox 10 Outdoors, I'm Chief Meteorologist Jason Smith.